Thank you very much. Just before we uh, present this award, I would just like to announce to everybody that uh, former A&R man for uh, Mushroom Records and EMI Records, Mr Neil Bradbury, unfortunately, uh, tragically died of a heart attack uh, on Saturday. And uh, on behalf of Chocolate Starfish, EMI, Mushroom and Aria, I would like to extend our sympathies to his wife, Linda, and their family. Yeah. Anyway, this is the uh, Aria yeah, for the best male performer. And of course, the first uh, real rock and roll superstars were male performers, Sis. This is obviously written by a male, I can see. <laughs> From Elvis Presley to Australia's own Johnny O'Keefe, they epitomised the rock and roll dream. It was all about energy, ambition, and an excess of tos testosterone. Yeah. Tostistostosterone. But we uh, live in much, much, much different times, and today's men are more civilised, mature, and professional artists. That's debatable. Yeah, I'm sure. So here are the nominees for the best Australian male performer of this year. Diesel. Ed Cooper. Chris Wilson. You surely love again. And the winner is... Diesel! Diesel. Yeah. AKA Michael Zott. Um, jeez, three years in a row, I don't know what to say. Um, some fine people in it this year, I must say, and I feel um, very honoured amongst that company, I must say. Um, I'd like to thank... Hi, Jesse. I nearly forgot. I'd like to thank my wife, Jep, of course, Lily, Jesse, Ian Smith, Michael Gudinski, uh, Barry Moore, Nicole, um, everyone at EMI, especially Linda Geddes and Neil Bradbury, who I'd like to dedicate this award to. Thanks, everybody.